Representatives from the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Air Force, the state of South Dakota, and industry partners gathered May 25, 2022 to conduct an official groundbreaking ceremony for the start of the B-21 Raider bomber bed down at Ellsworth Air Force Base. The historic building endeavor is the first awarded B-21 military construction project Air Force-wide and will provide a low observable restoration facility with paint booth type functionality in support of B-21 weapon system maintenance and operations. This is the first of about, I don't know, somewhere between two and three dozen projects at Ellsworth uh, in order to bed down this, this new aircraft here. So um, this is one of many and we look forward to awarding more, more contracts here uh, you know, in the near future as well as into the coming years. So uh, pace of construction, pace of progress uh, at Ellsworth. Uh, you know, this is an active B-1 base, so there's a lot of interest in, and uh, consideration for not impacting B-1 operations as we go about the delicate process of uh, you know, building new facilities and, and things like that. The groundbreaking ceremony was organized by Ellsworth Air Force Base. General Anthony Cotton, Commander Air Force Global Strike Command, provided the keynote address. The event was attended by USACE Northwestern Division Commander, Colonel Jeff Van Epps, Omaha District Commander, Colonel Mark Himes, South Dakota Representative Dusty Johnson, delegations from both South Dakota Senators, state and local government, local media, Air Force stakeholders, and many industry partners. This is the first project in a multi-billion dollar program that the Corps is going to execute over the next decade or so that's going to help the Air Force modernize its bomber leg of the nuclear triad. And in doing so, we're going to really uh, help improve and modernize uh, the uh, national defense and the security of our nation. USACE Omaha District is expected to proof and approve the remaining construction contracts while ramping up construction efforts over the next five years.